Hey guys, what's up? Welcome back to another video. Sorry for not posting for the last couple of days. I've been having to deal with a lot of shit, and this is just adding on to the pile. I made a new Twitter account. My new Twitter is out on the screen right now. It's at ZorAlt. There will be a link in the description. It'll be everywhere. There'll be an annotation on screen if I can get an annotation. But this is the story of how I got my Twitter suspended. Me, Jelly, and Zombify were just sitting in a call, just chilling, you know, and I tweeted a meme about Jelly. It was something along the lines of Jelly's YouTube channel is more dead than my grandma or some shit like that. And me and him were just, you know, being banterous and just fucking around. So Jelly's like, Zor, I'm gonna report you for being a cyber bully. So I'm like, all right, go ahead, kid. I'll, I'll just, let's just read this message. He's an absolute cunt and I fucking hate him. I wish my dad was here, but he sent me to an orphanage when I was like a half. I don't even know my mom because she's a lesbian. Zor is so mean to mean to me all day on Twitter and I'm seriously considering locking myself in a dog cage and continue continuously throwing myself off the roof until my body disintegrates. I'm so done. I'm quitting life by Twitter. I'm also also before I kill myself tell Zor he's a fat cunt. Bye daddy's also, also subscribe to my YouTuber channel as it is dead as fuck and I have 1.5k subs and average like 94 views. I would appreciate it a shout out so I could become famous on Twitter. I I don't get 2 million followers then I will kill myself. I have the dog cage ready. It's already on my roof waiting for me to lock myself inside it and continuously throw myself off the roof. Bye! Love you, baby. So as you can tell, this poorly written, horribly spelled message to Twitter got my Twitter account suspended. Now, I don't I don't even know why this actually happened. This happened five minutes after my account. I got logged out of my account. I was like, oh, okay, I guess, you know, something happened, maybe a glitch. It logged me out of my account. I didn't think anything of it. So I log back in and then it sends me this message. So it tells me something along the lines, you need to change your password, please, blah, blah, blah. Your account's been like suspended or some shit like that. So I change my, I try and change my password and it won't let me. When I try my email, it says this email does not exist. When I try my phone number, actually I can't try my phone number because I've done it way too many times and it's over here like saying, oh wait, you have too many Twitter accounts. When I have two, I just have this one and my main one. So I disconnected my phone from my, this one. So I'm trying to get it back. I've contacted Twitter. I sent in a support ticket. So I don't know how long this is going to last. A suspension, as people have been saying, can last month. Or since it's a false one, it could last, you know, maybe a week or two, maybe a month. I don't know. That is the only thing I'm worried about, is that I don't know how long this is going to last for. This poorly written message got me suspended on Twitter for I don't even know how long. It made me lose 5,000 followers in all of my quality meme. I don't even give a shit about the 5,000 followers. All I care about are my meme and my act. My Twitter is so fucking dead now. I tweet out something on my alt and I'll get like a like, maybe two if I'm fucking lucky. And I have 500 followers. So if you go to my Twitter and stay active, I'll fucking follow you and you can DM me porn if you want. I don't even give a shit. You can DM me whatever the fuck you want. Stay active on my Twitter, please. I'm, I'm desperate and I really need Twitter impressions. The main thing that I am worried about about this entire situation is how long this is going to last for. You know, like YouTube strikes, they tell you how long it's going to last for. It says three months for a YouTube strike. So I'm like, okay, how long can a suspension last? No one has an exact answer. And that's what's kind of freaking me out. Like if they just said, okay, in a month and a half, you'll have your Twitter account back. I'd be like, okay, I just have to use this alt account for a month and a half. And then I get to go back to my old one. But it's not saying anything. And there's a big difference between the word suspended and terminated. It just says my account is suspended. And I've never seen a Twitter account say terminated. So I'm very confused on what is going on about this entire situation. I I hope Twitter gets back to me soon so I can get my main account back. I will mention it in the next video if I do get my account back, but go follow my new Twitter. Please, I really need followers. The thing that m makes me so fucking confused is why? Did they not even read the report was so poorly written, had no grammar, all the words were misspelled and didn't make sense, but Twitter just suspended me anyways. Like, there's no way that they instantly saw the message, read it in five minutes, reviewed the case in five minutes, and then terminated me or suspended me in five minutes. There's no way. They had to have just seen it and then just suspended me. That's what I think is going on here. I think Twitter was just like, hey, there's this kid named Zor on the internet. We've noticed that he got a report. Why don't we just fucking suspend him for no apparent reason? Like people have sent in bomb threats 
They legit sent in a bomb threat and they got suspended. This other person said they lost a child on an airplane and then they DM them an anime girl and they got suspended. So me getting a false report equals to me having a bomb threat and, and messing with an airport. It just doesn't fucking make sense. This can't, you know, be a permanent thing. It's obviously I'm gonna get my account back. I just don't know when. This could last like a very fucking long time. I just, I, it just pisses me off that this entire situation happened. And at the same time, I don't even give a shit. I think it's fucking hilarious because the message was so dumb. So Twitter is just like, hey, why don't we just suspend this guy for absolutely no reason? This man right here is the one that got me suspended from Twitter. How? How does that even moderately make sense? He looks like a child predator. I feel like if I was a parent, I would not let him go near my kids because I think he would rape them. He falls asleep in Skype calls, can't even speak properly, and looks like a child molester. How did he manage to get me suspended from Twitter? I just don't get it. The man that created videos such as Phase Replay Stabbed Me got me suspended from Twitter. I'm slightly triggered at this entire thing, and Jelly, I would like you to do exactly this. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. Kill Shut yourself. The fuck. Please, please kill yourself. The fuck. You should really kill yourself. Mom, where the fuck is the bleach? Mom, I need bleach for memes. I need the memes, Mom. The fuck. Please, please kill yourself. The fuck? You should really kill poopy pee pee to say vagina. Women with dicks and weak men with vaginas. So fuck. This isn't even actual Windex. What the fuck is Glass Plus? You're delicate like mommy's fine china If you have complaints, please wait your turn and line up I got a message for these little fags trying to Be a mama's boy and the teacher's pet pimple face ass wipe Looking like they just had a gyna Colleges stick five fingers in your ass, no lube So what you gonna do? If you're number one, shove it up your ass and make it number two oh. Ladies getting mad in the comments and I'm hearing it You think it was a typo with these red lines and periods <laughs> <laughs> no comma, bitches with their self esteem, get out of the sauna. My shit lies in the sewers, closing the house. Please do not actually drink any of those liquids. I didn't, I just randomly made that video two days ago, just that little skit. I didn't know how to incorporate it into a video. So yeah, there's just a random shit post in this video now. And yeah, I, I don't know what else to say. Sorry for the bland video. Can we hit 100 likes on this video? This just really fucking upset me. So I'm gonna add, I don't, oh wait, I was gonna say I'm gonna have 10 minute ad revenue, but then I realized, oh wait, I don't have a fucking YouTube network. So yeah, I've I've just been having really bad luck recently and I'd, I'd appreciate a lot of likes and a lot of Twitter followers, that's just really it. I, all I care about is having not a dead Twitter. I'm very active on Twitter. I post a lot of Twitter videos and everything like that. So yeah, go go check it out. Link is in the description. It's on the screen too. I don't even, just please go follow me on Twitter. I'm, I'm gonna try and get my main account back and if I get it back, I'll make an update video or some shit saying, hey, I got my Twitter account back. Until now, I will be on that account. I'll have all my memes over there. I show sneak peeks to my videos. I, I, I just do a lot of dumb shit over there. So yeah, go check it out. So I'm not, also, I'm not gonna make a video about the YouTube heroes thing because I don't feel like throwing my two cents in. I, I don't like the system. I think it's stupid that YouTube is supporting false flagging. And I honestly think they should just be like, hey, you know, maybe YouTubers with over 50,000 subscribers get this or YouTubers that are verified get this because you have to have over 100K to get verified on YouTube now. Maybe it should be something like that. I just feel like it's very unregulated and needs more. So yeah, I, I just, I'm just very upset today. I, I'm just not in a good mood just because having 500 followers is very lonely. Going from 5k to 500 is very lonely. So yeah, go follow me, please. I'd appreciate it. I'd appreciate it. So I'll see you guys next time. I'm going to go fuck my dad. Yo nigga, what do you want? Let me get on your account. What could you possibly want to do with my account? You have tweeted some harmful things about Gen 11 Y, our supreme leader. It was just a meme. No, you hurt his feelings and we will not stand for it. Stop, stop. <laughs> I kind of forgot to say this in the video, but I do have a second channel and I'm going to be posting a vlog over there. I, 
It's not like, I don't know how to explain it. It's a really bad vlog, and obviously it's going to be bad, because I've never done any, like, real-life shit in a video before. I mean, I've done the skit today, the uh, little thing. I've done little things, but I've never done, like, a full-on vlog kind of thing, which I sort of did. So, yeah, I, I just want to say I did that. There will be a link in the description to my second channel, as usual. Just, again, go follow my Twitter because I feel very lonely with only 500 followers. I would appreciate more. And, yeah, I, I'll see you guys next time. Make sure to drop a like on the video if you did enjoy. Sorry for the bland video. Peace.